Bro, he just literally tore his pack. I've never seen somebody in person have a torn pack. That's nuts. That's nuts. And it's the morning, fellas. It's 4 o'clock in the morning. We're running late. Mom, we gotta go. I'm gonna be late to my flight. It's 4.30 and my flight leaves in an hour. Mom, I might not see you again. What about if the plane, like, like crash? You never see me again. Can you stop saying that? Seeing that. No, we're gonna have a lot of fun. The people that I'm going down to visit, I'll explain to you guys later, but they're really sketchy. Oh, they're, come on. What? I'm gonna get lost in the airport. Oh, so, <laughs> okay, we gotta go. My girlfriend's waiting for me in the car. Yeah, we'll, ca we'll catch up. I'll update you guys in a little bit. We're back. You know how I said that I was running late to the flight? I missed the flight, dog. So listen, me and my girlfriend get there. We are an hour and 20 minutes early before the flight. We get there. We're trying to check our bags in. There's a long line. There's like 60 people in line. We're waiting. We're in there for like 30 minutes. We get up to the desk. She's like, did you check in? I'm like, no. That's what I'm coming up here for, right? Oh, you're too late. You're supposed to check in 30 minutes before your flight boards. She said it with like a dead face. I thought she was like joking. I literally said to her, I was like, are you serious? She's like, yeah, I'll see if there's like any other flights, but you're not gonna be able to board this one. When I tell you I was ready to throw hands, I was literally about to go Chris Breezy for a second, but that happened. And now we're driving. Luckily it's only in New Jersey and I live in New York. So it's a four hour drive drive that's not bad we're still gonna make it i was getting flown out by this dude named enti he's pretty much a guy that's made his own pre-workout if you guys watch my tiktoks you guys have probably seen me review it before i reviewed it like a month back it's called echo vision so we've been talking we've been talking he hit me up he's like bro i'm flying out all my athletes today his pre-workout restocks it's like a huge restock he put in like so much money into it like it's literally just him and his manufacturers that he's doing it he's not that big of a company yet i'm not even an athlete and this man paid for my flight to fly down that's love right there this man spent six hundred dollars on a plane ticket and I missed the plane. <laughs> well, I feel like such a bad person right now. So it should be a fun time after I get there in four hours and 47 minutes. I am more than mad right now. So yeah update we're a mile away that was literally the most stressful trip i've ever taken i didn't know i was going straight through philadelphia i literally went straight through the city of philadelphia i was sitting in stop and go traffic for 45 minutes i'm gonna need some serious smooches to make up for this trip or bax is throwing hands see when you get there bro we have arrived. Fellas, we actually arrived yesterday, but I didn't want to record because I wanted the meeting to be organic. You know, I'm meeting a bunch of new people. I don't want to just shove a camera down their face, you know? We're, we're at this gym called Atlas. Look. The boys. We got Jack Harlow. Big show. Big show. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. And he's 4'9". He looks taller on camera, but he's actually 4'9". Training with David Lade today. So yeah, let's see how this goes and let's check out this gym, baby. Holy, holy, look at this, bro. This place is humongous, bro. Come on, baby. Come on. Up. 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 Got one more. The vibe in here is nuts, bro. I'm telling you. How's the workout so far, Jack? Bro, it's amazing. This, this gym's awesome. I know. I actually built this gym. It was kind of crazy. It took me a long time. Yeah, me and David Late actually yeah. created Atlas. Oh, that's him on the wall. Oh yeah, they, they have David. They have David Late on the wall, bro. All right, Jack Harlow's feeling frisky. He said he's gonna am wrap 225 on the bench. I just did it, so I'm already tired. And I did chest yesterday. I'm not gonna tell you how many he hit last time, but he just am wrapped. So come on, baby. Holy moly. How many is that? This man's over 10 already. Come on! Oh, how many was that, bro? 18. 18? Yo, he just hit 19 before that. Now he hit 18. You're gonna PR on bench? Now we got the PR. Wait a minute. Go spot him. Spot him, bro. All right, quick, 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 quick. Come on! Come on! Up! Come on! Wow. Let's go. Oh, sir. I got it. Yes, sir. How's your workout going so far, Big Show? Meow. 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 Mother effort. Honestly, hey, I'm not going to lie. Bax is the fucking man. It's literally my first time meeting him, and he's genuinely exact how he pays himself in videos. Like, legit, Bax is A1, bro. I fucking love uh, him. You're the man, bro. You're the, hey, you're the man. Yeah, you're the Low key. He's about to upgrade a lot with this content. He's about to get a new lens. He's going to be on top of his A game. Hey, love you, bro. Hey. Love you, bro. We're just messing around doing like as many back movements as we can. When I tell y'all, this man is a pre-workout guru. This man, Enti, is literally a pre-workout guru. He knows everything. This man right here knows his stuff. This man. I had to take off my grandma hat, bro. It's too hot in here, dog. Come on, Big Show. Come on, Big Show. Come on, Big Show. Uh. Yeah, it's the Big Show.
I haven't really been able to get a lot of content in here because I've been just chilling with the boys. So I drove in yesterday, we were just chilling. Today we woke up, we just had breakfast with the boys. I'm staying here until tomorrow night, so tomorrow I think I'll get better footage actually in the gym for you guys. But yeah, we're finishing up here. We'll see what we do next. We made it back. It's the night time. All right, so last night, we have two beds in the hotel. I'll show you. We have this one. We have this one. This is how I was sleeping. These, these selfish morons took the bed, and this is how I was sleeping. Literally like this. Woke up and he was on the floor. Tonight, that's not sliding. We're literally about to pull the heist of the century. We saw a door that's like cracked open, and we're about to go in there and steal their bed and take in a third bed. <laughs> we saw the people leave the fucking room. So this is the room. Alright, here's the bed. We're not sleeping on the chairs tonight. Let's go. This was our nightly heist. <laughs> it's like 1.30 at night right now. We're going to train legs tomorrow. Are you ready to train legs, mister? I don't train fucking legs. And then we'll we'll part our ways. They go back to Cali, and we'll meet again in another time. Never meet again. We'll never meet again. We are never meeting up again. But yeah. Squad's pulling up to Atlas once again. Attilus. The boys. I wish I could actually show you guys like how cool this gym actually is because the camera ain't doing it justice I guarantee it. Okay, so Enti just got in new flavors for his pre-workout and we're all trying them And we're gonna all decide on three flavors that he keeps. So this is sick. We're like in the process of him with pre-workout Looks like we're doing hard drugs on the table. They talked me into skipping legs. Now we're hitting shoulders Papa, Papa, what's up? Meow, meow, meow. I'm ready today. Warm up weight, 80s? This is warm-up weight for him. Yo, we stopped recording. We were just working out, bro. Our boy literally just tore his pack. There's a video of it. You'll get, you'll probably see it soon. Bro, he just literally wow. tore his pack. He literally was going for like 365 on bench. He took it like a champ, bro. He just stood up and started talking. He is probably so mad right now, bro, because yo, that he's gonna need surgery and everything. He's going to urgent care right now. I'll probably by the time this is uploaded, I'll have the video for you guys. But my boy gave me a motivational speech the day before and then tears his pack. I don't even feel like working out now. <laughs> I've never seen somebody in person have a torn pack. I'm so glad I didn't see it. Like real time, bro. All we were doing, we were over here literally just hitting shoulders, and we just hear him scream, and we all go running over to him. That's nuts. That's nuts. After seeing that, bro, I'm literally not working out. Here, we'll get a we'll get a little pump check. Before we go though, you guys didn't, literally didn't see me work out at all. So it will catch a quick set for you guys. I don't go. And we ended off there. Yeah, we pulled up to the ER, bro. I wish I was joking, but we really weren't. He really tore his pack. Me, Gage, and Chase about to go see him. I'm not gonna bring in the camera in because that's grimy, but yeah, we'll see how this goes. So yeah, today was a crazy day. Everyone left, they went to the airport. I'm still waiting in his house. I'm about to drive back. You never know what's gonna happen, bro. So just be careful. That's why one rep maxing is not even worth it, bro. He he didn't know that was gonna happen. He didn't have any prior pain. He didn't have anything. I'm gonna get back. I have a five hour drive, so we'll pick up this video whenever I get home. I'll see you guys then. Yo, so we're back. That was one of the biggest weekends I think I've ever had. We were nonstop doing things. I couldn't even record. Trust me, I did not get enough footage during that trip, but I didn't want to really be recording all the time. I want, As I said before, I wanted to have an organic interaction with all these people that I'm meeting for the first time. And I didn't really get to explain really why I was there. So there was a restock, so we flew everyone out. It was a big thing. I think he sold $180,000 worth. And that's crazy for someone that's not like mainstream. He's still like relatively small, you know? I'm not even a part of his team. I'm not even an athlete. And he literally paid for everything. Like everything. Thing we did there he paid for that man deserves everything he's gonna get because this is seriously gonna be the next big thing i think i got a little bit of an announcement for you guys all right so the long-awaited announcement ah as of yesterday, I am no longer a part of Anaka supplements. I'm still a part of the clothing brand, but I have parted ways from the supplement side of Anaka. As you guys know, I always keep it 100 with you guys, and I always try to be as transparent as I can with you. So I'll give my reasoning as why I left. To be completely honest with you, they're just overpriced. And you're gonna have that. They just got into the supplement game. They're just starting out. They're gonna fix things as they go. But when you have to pay close to $100 for, for pump and pre every month, that's gonna run your bank. And I personally know that you can get your money's worth somewhere else and not have to pay $100. I didn't really wanna push something that I would not 
not by myself. I would use the product. Like, uh, don't get me wrong. This stacked with the pump is actually really good. For the price, you can get the same and better. I didn't really want to push this onto people because I always told myself that I would not endorse something that I wouldn't use myself. Like a Nakas Clothing A1. I love the quality. I wear this every single day. You guys know I do not go anywhere without my Naka. The one thing I never want someone to think of me is that I'm just pushing a product out there for revenue. Because obviously when you guys use my code, I get commission. I get money from you guys using my code. I made my TikTok. I made my whole brand around just helping people people and I want to do that as much as I can using my code on things is just a way of helping me do this helping me out so I can put more of my time into creating content for you guys into focusing on this more as like my main focus in life you guys don't actually know how much that actually means to me when you guys go out of your way to use my code with all that being said the other big announcement I now have a code with echo vision first off before we get into the nitty-gritty on why I'm joining my code is is GMA for for grandma bro I was gonna use code backs but some moron took code backs so I can't even use code backs right now m's gonna try to get that fixed but for now my code's gma so if you guys want to support me you guys want to get 10 percent off on some echo vision use code gma until we get code backs but so you guys saw this whole trip you guys saw this whole youtube video i was not an athlete for the team none of that he literally flew me out paid for everything he paid for my gas he paid for my meals he paid for my stay at a hotel he paid for everything out of his own pocket i don't think you guys understand how grateful i was for that it really made me feel special it made me feel like i was a part of something part of a team a family and literally i met these people like i met everyone on the echo vision team i met m for the first time that weekend was one of the best times i've had in recent times and i didn't even get a lot of footage we had such a good time there once again i said this a lot in the video but i didn't want to record i just wanted it to be organic i just wanted it to be didn't want to be holding the camera all the time i just wanted to meet these guys and know how they are as people we literally sat down on a table and i helped them pick the two flavors that were going to go live now the flavors blackberry lime and watermelon are live on the page me myself we taste tested that and voted on the flavors to go live like that's what i mean like he tries to include everybody this man m is such a selfless person he makes every Everyone on his team feel like they are a part of something and that is one of the most important things you need to do when you're running a company and that is what really caught my eye I saw this man blowing up on TikTok months ago like probably two or three months ago before I even got in contact with him I was like man this guy is literally gonna go places his transparency his like genuine personality is just insane not only does he know his stuff about pre-workout and supplements and all of that I'm not even sugarcoating this this is the best pre-workout I've ever tried in my life pump and focus is off of the charts he's taking these risks that no one in the industry is willing to make and it's working everyone literally i've not seen any legitimate bad reviews of this pre-workout yet he has so many things coming up for this company and i'm literally so happy to be a part of this hopefully you guys listen to me when i tell you this right now echo vision is literally going to be one of the biggest things in the coming years that was the big announcement guys if you guys want to support me once again code gma on your echo vision orders it is now live they're still in stock i think there's about six thousand tubs left it's not only supporting me but it's directly supporting I literally want to see this man succeed so bad. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. And hey, you already know we're going to be back next week for another banger. Let me know how you liked it in the comments. We is do be out. I'll give you a good night, good morning kiss, whatever it is. We'll see you in the next one, baby. We is do be out.